welcome to perfect guardian and i am going to tell you about difference between himalayan rivers and peninsular rivers now rivers play a crucial role in the lives of people in india their importance can be gauged by the fact that most indian cities are situated on the banks of a river river water is necessary not just for drinking and washing but also for irrigation of crops there are seven major rivers and their tributaries providing water to people and flowing across the cities and emptying in bay of bengal however there are also rivers that take a different course and empty themselves in the arabian sea indian rivers are mainly classified as himalayan rivers and the peninsular rivers based upon their origin there are some differences between these rivers that will be highlighted in this video now what are himalayan rivers the three most important himalayan rivers are ganga indus and the brahmaputra these are actually river systems as they are joined in the journey by many tributaries these rivers are perennial rivers as they are not dependent upon rainfall to feed them they originate in the himalayas as a result of melting of ice and glaciers all these rivers and their tributaries produce large plain areas and are deep enough to be navigable in the start of the journey these himalayan rivers also prove to be a great source of hydroelectricity falling from a great height these rivers have great flow and velocity of water causing erosion of land form in the way now peninsular rivers now the origins of peninsular rivers lie in plateau and small hills there is no snow to feed water and as such these rivers are seasonal and dry up in summers these rivers do not have a high erosion activity as they flow through gentle slopes the flow of water in these rivers is also at slow pace not allowing for meandering of rivers however these rivers still prove abundant source of hydroelectricity now what's the main difference between himalayan cities and peninsular cities himalayan rivers are perennial in nature whereas peninsular rivers are seasonal in nature and dry up in summers as they are dependent upon rainfall himalayan rivers cause much erosion and have great flow of water whereas peninsular rivers create much less erosion and also have a weaker flow of water himalayan rivers are meandering whereas peninsular rivers are straight himalayan rivers create great plains suitable for agriculture urbanization and industrialization they are some of most densely populated areas in the country Himalayan rivers originate in Himalayas whereas peninsular river originate in small hills and plateaus Himalayan rivers are much longer and deeper than peninsular rivers basins of Himalayan rivers are much deeper than the basins of peninsular river Himalayan rivers irrigate the northern plains whereas peninsular river gates rivers irrigate the deccan plateaus so thank you please subscribe to my channel perfect guardian and give your comments